Bayern centrism is the ideology of biodiversity and that human life is not more special than any other living creature on the whole planet. It is the, it is the moral position that mo a lot of um, animal rights people view, know a lot also about the environment hold. This is the direct opposite of its centrism. What centers on the viral of humans was one on, would actually been in a sort of way the same as Nazism, as Nazis, Nazism but only viral the life of Nazis and not other groups. Beyond centrism is the ideology that all living creatures be not more special than them. That's that e that actually the most uh, protected animal species that's been the last amount on the planet, and that's caused the least amount of harm to the environment and don't put the ecosystem the ecosystem out of its position the environment is the is more special than others that destroy the environment like humans do humans like uh, to destroy many um it's a lot of things because of their insane belief of human supremacism or human exclusivism or human or anthropocentrism or the belief that humans are uh, being more important with any rational reason than any other creature or thing on the planet and that human life is more fun than the life of another creature. Even bees, for example, the bees disappear. The whole ecosystem will be negatively affected by it. If the ants disappear, also a, lo a whole part of the ecosystem, of the ecosystem, of the ecosystem, will be destroyed. And also, if the wheels disappear, um, a lot of the uh, environment will also be destroyed because then a lot of the protoplankton, phytoplankton, uh, that uh, produce not are actually something like seventy percent of our oxygens in the in this world will decrease to uh, and go to to extinction. There's also high sh sharks and other. Uh, Architects of um, the um, of the environment um, actually I serve and um, put in balance because um, compost of the um, wheels it creates um, actually a very good um, sodium and natrium rich. Uh, and feed for the protoplanktons and also they put the protoplanktons higher in the water where they can uh, easily appropriate. Also gorillas, I mean also at least by my opinion, more than 10 times at least as uh, important than humans and I will also say I find also sometimes even 100,000 times as important as humans because, uh, because gorillas don't cause an extremely amount of damage to the environment and to the ecosystem and to next 
generations of um, creatures on this planet. In contrast with humans, which they are greedy, they greed, uh, selfishness, arrogance. You know, a lot of parts I decree, I absolutely stand on the part of um, Paul Watson of Sea Shepherds. Uh, the Japanese government have to stop with um, protecting the eco terrorists that uh, call them that call themselves uh, so euphemistically waders and stop in the reality stop out there self is totally insane ex out of this world to you and adopt one um, bio um, centric geocentric um, view point because without the whales without the bees without all the insects and all the protoplanetisms without trees, without all that, the environment and the earth will not be lower the way it now be. And life will in the next five, 50 to 60 years. All truths of the past three stages. First, it be mad and ridicule. Because humans always Make fun of things that they not can understand, particularly if it being if you do not something selfish or do something nice to another. You only have to look to history what you must do to each other. Second thing people know that there have to come one change. People do what they can do to stop the change and don't have to do something on it. Because humans don't like chase. The humans don't like the truth. Majority, of course. Not all. But the majority. It's always the majority. It's all anything of tech which I don't can understand. Without overthinking it. Look to the history of slavery. Actually, the most uh, slavery historic, you see. Uh, being agreed that slavery first existed in the ancient societies of humans that first have created um, animal agriculture. And that's not so surprising that slavery gets slavery. The victim is nothing to defend, the defend don't care what any other victim thinks. The victims are interchangeable. And the swords do not feel the pain that it inflicts. Veganism is not a diet, it is a moral imperative. No matter from which position you look at, or you look at it from an environmental perception, or you look at it from well, human rights perception that, that take around something like um, 1.5, um, actually 90 um, pounds of greens to make one pound of animal flesh and that we feed around something like uh, 69 to 80 percent of all the greens and all their plant products to the billions of uh, animals in the concentration camps 150 billion actually and that we feed around something like 40 percent of all the um, fish and fish are in the trees to um, livestock and that can be many kinds of animals from dolphins to sea turtles to sharks and whale species etc. And also a lot of the time dying the control nets. Think about it. Don't uh, and not to uh, say something um, totally not overthinking in the comments and stop um, with um, consuming animal products and also um, see animals because there don't exist something as uh, sustainable fishing anymore in 2007. 
2017. That's just one social relation absolute law. The biodiversity in the sea is not doing so well. So if you've been a president of a country and you looked, you know, to this video, I say look in these numbers and make the right decision by banning fishing in your country. And stop giving subsidies to industries that abuse animals and pollute the environment and become um, true and honest and rational and safe leader stands or someone that only live on documents. Just When darkness and light become one, the reality splits away and the truth becomes visible. 